Hello and welcome to Canva series. If you think that you are a regular Canva user, then you might want to watch this video till the end. Because in this video, I will share 20 Canva hacks share This hacks will not only save your time to make your designing process easier, but will also help you get a stunning result at the end. As a company session consulting, we provide you Canva training for beginners. So if you are interested to learn Canva with us, please check out the description below and fill out the form. Now, are you excited to learn 20 amazing Canva hacks? Then let's jump right in. But before we move on with the video, make sure that you watch our previous video if you are an absolute Canva beginner. And also make sure to watch two of our videos from Canva series. Subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell button so that you do not miss out on any further updates. Now without a further ado, let's get into my computer. So here we go, let's start with one of my favorite and an important feature of Canva, that is elements. We are starting with basics but stay with me till the end to move gradually into more interesting ones. Here I am taking only circle, rectangle and a star but you can go to the search bar and find any kind of free elements that you want in your design. Now what makes the element feature of Canva so powerful is you can change the colors of the elements to your brand color or any color of your choice. You can also resize and place it as per your requirement. Next locking the elements. Has it ever happened to you? You place an element into a perfect place, you are finally happy with the design and suddenly by mistake you move that. I feel you. So in order to avoid such a situation, immediately lock the elements like so when you are happy with the placement. Another hack is grouping the element. If you could design different elements on the text or on the you can select those all and group the element. As you can see, my group is I can move them all together. Now let's say you just change your mind and you want to move it individually then again you can go to ungroup and move them like so next hack is copy and paste from past designs let's say you have a brand element or kuna element and by some chance you are not able to find it then you can totally go to your previous designs and then copy and paste those elements in your present design like I'm doing here right now. Next hack is selecting difficult layers. Let's say design Gordejada you end up making multiple layers and now you are having trouble selecting your desired layer. Now what you can do is paste CTRL plus click on the left button to choose the layer as you want and bring it forward to edit. Now next thing that you can do with elements is duplicate the element. So this will like simply element ma click or no the light duplicate color you can use it to place it in other places. Likewise, you can also duplicate the pages. Now, let's say you are happy with your design, but still, let's say try to do something design or change the You can simply um, duplicate the page so that you do not miss out the first one, and then try out any other changes that you would like to make or you would want to experiment. So that your changes are you can always go back to your first design. Now next hack is all about single key shortcut such as press L and you will get a line. Press C and you will get a circle. Press R and you will get a rectangle. And press T to get a text box without having to go in the toolbar. Now final shortcut is shortcut for duplicating the elements. Simply press ctrl plus d and get your elements duplicated now next hack is all about speeding the process of your image upload now instead of downloading the image and again uploading it to the canva you can simply drag the image from the folder and drop it to canva 
now next thing that you can do to speed up your process is to copy and paste image from other websites again instead of downloading it and then uploading it in the canva you can simply copy the desired image and then paste it in your workspace in canva now next hack is to add a blur effect in the image just go like go to edit image and look for the blur option now you will see three different options as my edit up le automatically gone boy when the whole image blur also and you can also increase or uh, decrease the intensity like so now if you click on blur then you will get a brush ra tyo brush chai tapai le afno desired area haru chai blur garna saknu huncha this way you can blur any faces if you want it to be confidential tesai gari kunai sensitive information haru cha bhane pani tapai le blur garera tesai information haru lai chai confidential rakhna saknu huncha now next hack is to add a white outline to your image this ko lagi you need to choose an image with no background in it then go to edit image choose glow ra tesma double click garnu hola bring the blur down to 0 increase the transparency to 100 then i'm changing the color of outline from black to white and then also you can increase or decrease the size of the outline like i'm doing in the screen next up is tidy up feature now let's say you have some elements all over the places then you can tidy it up and align it to one place by choosing the tidy up option simply go to the position and then look down where you will find the tidy up option at this let choose garnu bhayo bhane chai canva le automatically tapai ko elements har lai align gardincha now gradient is yet another interesting feature of canva simply go to the search bar and type gradient and then you will come across some of the interesting gradient effects on canva then click on graphics to make sure that you are getting the editable uh, gradient you can also change the color of the gradient to your brand color or color of your choice like so next hack is all about text effect after typing your text go to effects and then you will see some of the coolest effect that you can have on your text keep playing around until you find the text effect that interests you One of the most interesting effect that Canva has is curve effect. You can also increase or decrease the size of the curve. Similarly, you can also pull it inward or outward. This is yet another powerful hack of Canva which is inserting a hyperlink. You can insert a hyperlink to any of your text or images. Here I am using text. Download a PDF format and send it to anyone concerned like I'm doing here. Have a look. Next hack of Canva is using the ruler and margin. Go to file and click on so rulers and guides. Again go to file and click on so margins. Esari guideline bhitra basera kaam garda chai tapai ko designing process ekdamai sajilo huna janchha. Now next hack is about how you can zoom in and zoom out easily. Instead of going down and zooming in and zooming out the usual way you can simply press control plus and control minus to zoom in and zoom out respectively. Now next hack remove background from the image. Disclaimer this is a pro feature of Canva. Don't worry I will also tell you how you can remove background even if you don't have a pro account. Coming back to remove background using Canva, go to edit image and choose remove background and here the background is removed. 
If you don't have a pro account, you can go to remove.bz to remove the background of your image for free. Follow the steps as shown on screen. Next up, we have Brand Kit. Did you know you can create a brand kit using Canva? A complete brand kit option is available in the Pro feature. However, in free version, you can add a brand color palette to make your designing process a lot more easier and faster. Alright guys, we are almost there and I have saved the best for the last. Let's say you are running out of time and you need to make a design for different social media platforms. All you need to do is to go to social media, choose quick create and make a design. What happens is with less time and effort, you can create many designs at once. Here's how you can do it. You can also change the color palette from the given options. And here, with a very less time and effort, my post for the three platforms are ready. Now finally, Canva Video Editor is yet another hack of Canva which mostly goes unnoticed. You can create videos from Canva in various formats such as YouTube, social media ads and so on. You can even create a TikTok video and Instagram Reels from Canva from a readily available templates. Alright guys, that is it for today's tutorial. I hope you found this video helpful and if you did, please leave us a comment below. Also write down what kind of topics you would want us to cover, anything related to digital marketing, tools and strategies. We will try our best to bring out the similar content that you want. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell button. Follow us on social media. I'll see you in next video. Bye-bye.